This video provides a brief overview of the AppDynamics database monitoring solution and describes some of the metrics collected. You can see an overview for each database on the Databases tab. The Queries graph shows the total number of queries monitored for the database. Time in Database indicates the total time spent executing those queries. When enabled, hardware monitoring metrics show the percentage of CPU capacity consumed by the database. The dashboard for each instance presents a summary of key performance indicators over time. Server health at the top of this window indicates the extent to which health rules are being violated. At a glance of the load bar, you can see the total number of calls during the specified time period and the number of calls for any point in time. The number of calls to the database directly correlates with database performance. The more calls there are, the longer it takes to respond to each call. The time spent in database line shows the total time spent executing SQL statements at any point in time. Top 10 SQL wait states show the activities that contribute to the time it takes the database to service the request. The wait states consuming the most time may point to performance bottlenecks. Average number of active connections shows the average number of sessions established between the database client and the database server at any point in time. The CPU, memory, disk I.O., and network I.O. graphs display when the database collector has been configured to also monitor the database host hardware. The CPU graph shows the relative percentages of CPU processing time used for handling system and users' processes. The memory graph shows the percentage of total memory in use at any point in time. The disk I.O. graph shows the volume of data read and written. The network I.O. graph shows the volume of data sent and received. The live view shows current key performance metrics, SQL wait states, and if hardware monitoring is enabled, it shows resource consumption metrics, such as the CPU and memory for the database server. A list of all currently connected sessions is also displayed. The queries window displays the top SQL queries and stored procedures. These are the queries that consume the most time executing within the database instance. Comparing the weighted percentage measurement allows you to understand exactly which queries are consuming your database resources. You can drill down into an individual query to see details about who executed it and how much resources it consumed. You can also drill down into the execution plan for the query, which can help you determine if the query is using an efficient access path. The database clients window shows you the host names or IP addresses of the top clients using the database. To see the top queries executed by a client, click the host name or IP address to filter the top queries view. The database sessions window shows you the session ID of the top sessions using the database. From here, you can drill down into a session to see the queries run by that individual session. When you detect a problem with database performance, you may be able to correct the problem by adding an index. Using the object browser, you can browse through the database objects to better understand the existing schema. AppDynamics database monitoring provides many reports whose availability depends on the database platform being monitored. Common to all supported platforms are the wait state, top activity, and time comparison reports. By examining the wait state report, you can see the wait states consuming the most time, which may point to performance bottlenecks. For example, DB file sequential reads may be caused by segment header contention on indexes or by disk contention. Use the top activity report to see which SQL statements are using the most database time. This helps to determine the impact of specific SQL statements on overall system performance, allowing you to focus your tuning efforts on the statements that have the most impact. The Time Comparison Report enables you to compare the performance of your development and production databases before and after you tune the SQL queries or add an index or join, allowing you to determine the effectiveness of any performance tuning procedures you have implemented. The Metric Browser presents a visual comparison of the collected metrics. 
Using the metric browser, you can have App Dynamics determine what is normal behavior by creating a baseline against which you can compare current performance metrics. Thank you for using App Dynamics. For more, go to appdynamics.com.